Hello there guys, welcome back to my channel. This is your teacher, Teacher Daryl Del Mundo. And today, I will teach you how to make another learning materials using Tautoons. Are you ready to listen? Just follow these basic instructions and you will learn how to make your own Tautoons learning material. So first things first, let us go to our browser, go to your Google Chrome, and then just type there, Powtoon.com. And when you are in your Powtoon.com, if you have your profile already, you can just log in. If you do not have it, you can just sign up. Just put your some of your informations or details about yourself, if you're a teacher, a student, or whatsoever. So if you have your profile with you, just start, or just click log in. Then right after that, your email address and then your password. Then just click log in. There you go. And just wait. Okay lang, ano lang naman to. Imimit ko rin to para lang makuha ko yung ano. Okay, so you are now in your dashboard. So in your dashboard, since I choose as a teacher, this is just a free trial. So the premium trial ends for about three days. Okay. So this is what the Fountains dashboard looks like. Okay. So you have your students' project, teachers and faculty, administrative staff, and all. Then on your right side, you can find the home templates, import file, and then blank. Okay, from scratch, meaning to say, if you want to make a blank sheet of Powtoons animation, just choose it. But if you want some uh, like built-in templates, just click templates. Okay, there you go. So you can see up here the different templates that they have. It's like a specific templates for learning and development, knowledge and sharing, employee engagement and all. Then another specifications based on the needs of your students. And then when we go back here, you can just choose all templates. Then when you go down, you will see all the templates. Okay. Just choose what kind of template that you wanted to use that suits and cater your students' need. Okay, there you go. So for an instance, let us choose this one about coronavirus. Okay, so just click it and then you will see the preview of this one. So this is what the preview looks like. It will show you the entire duration of the animation. Okay, so if you want to edit this template, just click edit this template on your lower left click it then it will bring you to another window just wait one eternity later three days later and we're still waiting for the turtle net <laughs> so let's wait for the loading and there you go so you will see here the slides that we are going to edit so we chose this slide so you can see there the different pictures texts and some shapes that you need to edit so if you wanted to change it or edit those text or those images just double click it okay so here are the different slides So it's like a PowerPoint presentation, but this time you are going to make your own video presentation using Powtoons. Okay, so since this is all about coronavirus, so all the details here, all the information are all about coronavirus. So there, as you can see, when you double click it, you can edit it. There you go. You can bold, italicize, underline, or choose the alignment or the center or left or right or what color it is the arrangement and even the effects okay that is also considered with those editing stuff or those controls okay and then link you can also link it from other website too so when you click the images you can see there's swap 
and then pose you can choose different poses here so since this slide is like an introduction so we need to make the image or the photo like a waving images so you can reposition change the position of this one you can swap their position it depends upon your Pautons what will be the outcome will look like so that's very basic okay if you want to edit also the other slides the same procedure just double click the text or even the images or the shapes that you wanted to edit then if you feel like that you are done with the editing just click the export and then download video as mp4 so that will be the format of your powtoons and mp4 so if you feel like that you are already done with the editing you already arrange the different slides because you need to double check the slides or else you're going to edit it again and then you will save it again if the arrangement is not correct so you will download it the file if you are done double check triple check it okay so i hope you learned something today and do not forget to like share and subscribe to my channel teacher da teacher daryl del mundo and right now at this point i will show you my sample of powtoons just wait for a minute and watch this okay See you guys!